Welcome to this video. I am Sana Srivastava from Ecoholics presenting the description of macroeconomics. So in the last video we have discussed about what is the meaning of microeconomics and in this video we'll continue this discussion and will lead to macroeconomics. Understanding the macroeconomics is very very important from the perspective of major examinations. When we talk about macroeconomics it deals with generally income and employment so this macroeconomics is also known as the theory of income and employment in general sense when we compare with the microeconomics macroeconomics deals with aggregates here aggregates means aggregates like national income aggregates like important aggregates of inflation important uh, aggregates of price level etc so here in this video i'll discuss about some major important heads that we will cover in macroeconomics so first of all we draw that flow chart so under macroeconomics we've divided under three important heads first one is theory of income and theory of income and employment under this theory we have two important theories first one is theory of consumption function and theory of theory of investment function the second head is theory of general general price level and inflation theory of general price level and inflation and third one is theory of economic growth so here economic growth is very important from the perspective of macroeconomics because it deals with aggregates here under theory of income and employment major macroeconomics consider about this part theory of consumption function and theory of investment function are the two most important pillars of macroeconomics after that this is the part related to mainly banking and monetary sector so theory of general price level and inflation is deals with macroeconomics here we will discuss about the certain indices to calculate inflation and what are the effects of inflation on the economy under general price level because microeconomics deals with the individual prices of a commodity so when we aggregate all these individual prices of the particular commodity we will arrive at a general price level of a country here inflation rate of not a particular com uh, particular commodity but here inflation rate is of a total country so like for example india is having inflation rate or we can say around 4.9% talking about theory of economic growth here there are some models of economic growth like for example india adopted on the first five year plan about herat domer model so we'll discuss all the models herat domer model robert soro model etc all the models will come under the theory of economic growth so just keep in mind that macroeconomics deals with aggregates so just to remember this here a means aggregates so aggregates like national income aggregates like gdp aggregates like inflation price level general price level etc obviously will come under macroeconomics hope you like this introductory video stay tuned for more videos related to macroeconomics where we will explain all these important topics you can download the ecoholics app for the full course that is related to ugc net examination indian economic service and upsc economics optional If you like this video give a big thumbs up and as well as subscribe the Ecoholics and click on the bell icon to get the instant notification of new videos. If you have any doubt you can mention in the comment box or you can also send a WhatsApp message to the number given in the description of this video. Once again thank you so much have a nice day.